you're sorry. Okay, guys, it's Saturday morning, and yes, I'm showing you without any makeup on. And look at Austin. <laughs> he's getting ready, and he's got a shower cap on. Look at his nice ensemble. Nice, yeah. nice jammies. You guys wanna get with me? He just because I look so sad. He just watched Good Neighbor, whatever. I was watching Good Neighbor stuff where Kyle's singing while doing his chores. Whoa. See, I sing while wearing a cap and brush my teeth. Okay, we're gonna get ready and we're gonna look really good in about 20 minutes. <laughs> 15. Um, would you? I'm gonna go ahead and check dirty. Arthur, do you like your blanket there? Yeah? You like that? Yeah, so Arthur, uh, we, we, we just, uh, cleaned this blanket not too long ago, and he would not, like, we put another towel, I think we put a towel down. Wasn't it a towel? Yeah, it was a towel. Yeah. We were cleaning the blanket, we laid a towel down, and he wouldn't lay on it. He would lay off to the side. But now that we put the blanket back down, he lays on it again. It's so, you're such a goof. You don't make any sense. Dogs are so random, man. So goofy. Okay, so we were sitting here talking and I said, let me ask the audience and see what they think. Do you think that she looks like a tomboy? I always feel like I look like a, not that it matters, but I always feel like I look like a tomboy if I wear like jeans with tennis shoes. Is that weird to say? Um, well, you don't look like a tomboy. You look like a hot girl. Okay, well, cool. You look like a hot girl that I will allow to be on public today. We're listening to Brent's favorite Taylor Swift song. literally just sitting here like praising Taylor Swift. Yeah, we really were. Well, actually, were we like using her as an idol? Were we worshiping her? No, I, I will never get to that level. Austin said he was t swizzled last night. How <laughs> inappropriate is that? <laughs> I was like, well, we were about to go and she's like, I, I grabbed the iPod. She's like, oh good, I want to listen to Taylor Swift. I'm like, really? I'm always down to listen to T-Swizzle. And she's like, yeah. And then I was like, I just got T-Swizzled last night. <laughs> Inappropriate. Inappropriate, but funny. Whatever that is. <laughs> <laughs> Taylor Swift is the master of making the most simple stuff sound amazing. I would agree. She really I would, is. I would and agree. she's totally original, which is nice. Except I cannot listen to this song. Oh my gosh. It does not have correct grammar. I cannot okay, listen to it. Okay, on her newest album, she has that song called Innocent, and she's like, You're still an innocent. And that Britney cannot me stand so it. so much. Because and innocent what? Like she just says you're an innocent. Like it should be you're innocent or you're an innocent yes. person. Like she should only you should only use the word uh, innocent as an adjective or a verb. And she uses it as a noun. And Brittany does not appreciate I that. I don't appreciate that. Not that I have perfect grammar, but and no, I'm not criticizing her. I know you guys are always like, why are you guys bashing people? I'm not bashing her. I just don't like that. Well, I'm freaking in love with Taylor Swift. I will have an affair with her over my wife. Hey, that makes me sad. That was a joke. Let's yeah, listen to it again. <laughs> okay, we're here at Olive Garden. We're gonna get our, our Italian grubbing on. Tell me if someone if this starts falling on me so I can get out of the way. Yeah, we don't want you to like be knocked out or anything. No. So we've never been to this Olive Garden, but it's really nice. Like check this out. They got like a fireplace. It's like it's like yeah, cool jazz. And cool jazz, which it's kind of Usually they play Italian music. And they have me here. Yeah. So, you know. Usually they play Italian music like. Okay, so any place we go, we always analyze our waiter or our waitress. Not to be mean. Not a mean way. Like she's actually really good. But it's really funny because we feel like she's like really aggressive. Like, like. like she was like, do you want any more salad? We were like, yeah. And then she was just like, <laughs> I think what like snatched it up. She's very focused. Like she has three tables and I think she's just like, wants to get everything done. Really yeah. Like she's on it. She's good. But it's just funny because like, she's like, would you like another drink? Okay. We always analyze, like, we always like think about like what our waiter or waitress is thinking while they serve us, you know? Like what's going on in their mind. Probably because we both have been in jobs like that. And I mean, we have respect. We, like, like he said in the Coach Dan video, we always tip, tip our waiter and waitresses, right? Yeah. Cap up! Cap up! You got tipped. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about you guys, that looks kind of chauncey. Actually, what does that even mean? You say that all the time. It means like, not a lot. Like, kind of, not, I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> 
like sparse. She's sparse, also that's what it is. Sparse. Yeah. It or kind of sparse. Just boatsy. Sparse mixed with like kind of ghetto. She, she's always like, oh, that looks kind of Chauncey. <laughs> I'm like, okay, Chauncey Phillips, he plays for the Knicks. Alright, so Olive Garden was pretty much less than expected. It wasn't that great. But, um, yeah, so Britt got hit on while we were in Olive Garden. She was just, she went to the bathroom, and then some guy... I was minding my own business walking back, and this guy was like, Hey, hottie, but he was a waiter. Like, that's kind of inappropriate, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, like, you're not supposed to be doing that kind of stuff while you work. He was like, hey, hottie, and then he, like, turned around, I was like, because I was just surprised. Like, I was in my own little world, you know. I was like, what? Excuse me. I was hoping that we could see him on our way out because I was going to walk up to him and be like, hey, hottie. <laughs> Why? What? What you want, fool? You going to be talking about my girl like that? I know she's hot. Actually, I don't blame you for saying that. What's your number? Let's hang out sometime. <laughs> so now, what are we going to do? We're going to go walk well, around. Starbucks is definitely in our near future. <laughs> oh, really? Today is cheat day, guys. Cheat day is on Saturday, which means I eat really healthy or at least try to. Minus that pizza I ate on Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> I try to eat really healthy six days of the week in my dark. No. Oh. Um, so that on one day a week I can eat unhealthy. You're hot. Thanks. I can see why he said that about you. Baby, get over it. I shouldn't even told you. I shouldn't have said anything. No, it's fun. I, I really don't care. I mean, it's funny. Like, and actually I'm really not surprised. Are you guys surprised that she gets head on? Not me. I you're always like, you're I've always like, married, people don't like, think. I never get hit on. You're always, you're always like, oh, no one thinks I'm that hot. No one's ever going to think that. I'm like, people well, think I that a lot. And actually, care. we're always out in public walking around and people will be like, like dudes will walk past her and be like, like looking at her booty being no. like, oh, I'm going to tap that. Baby, <laughs> that is so inappropriate and that is not even true. Inappropriate. Do you call foul ball? Oh, man. <laughs> Foul ball. All right, maybe we should go somewhere. I feel like we're the shaytards. I always say that whenever we're just sitting around vlogging, because they always do that. They always just stop somewhere and just start vlogging. Hey, we're vlogging here. Hey, hey, we're vlogging here. <laughs> that was really bad. That was a terrible impression. Oh, you were trying to impersonate. No, I actually really wasn't. Oh, I wasn't. If I let's see, let me, I'm gonna try it for real this time. Ready? Hey, we're vlogging here. Oof. That was, that was also bad. That was very loud, but yeah, it's hard to have a shade voice. It is. What if I could sound like Mommy Tard? I can sound like her voice whenever she does that one character. Hey guys, it's Katilla Tate. Sorry I haven't made a video. <laughs> <laughs> that's like right, that's pretty that. good. She hasn't done a video in so long. Katie Let, if you're watching this, not that you are because you don't watch these videos, but if you are. She follows please, us on Twitter. Please, please make a Katie Let video. Katie Let. And a t-shirt. Make hey, a video for my guys, life so she'll comment, stop talking about you all the guys, time. No, comment and like cool. tweet them because I really want a Katie Lett shirt. They have Shea Carl shirts. That is fence, very true. But I want a Katie Lett shirt. Like I would die to wear a Katie Lett shirt. Okay, that is God. very true because, uh, yeah. Katie Lett is- I, I don't have anything to say. I'm just- Yay, box heads. We're in Bath and Body Works because it's where Britt likes to go, but she used to work here and apparently, wait, they got a dress code? Yeah, they had a dress code where you can only wear khakis or black. And, and now they can wear jeans. And I'm like, that's so cool. Oh, yeah. This stuff works the best. We always buy that this stuff because stuff I always destroy the bathroom since so she just sprays it after. Oh, in the car stuff, these, these car things are great. Don't we always get this one, the cinnamon sugar one? Yeah. Or no vanilla sugar. sugar. Yeah. We should probably get some of that because I might do that later tonight. What? So we're going over to Best Buy now because uh, Britt wanted to go in that girly store. <laughs> okay, this is how I got And I was like, I want to go there. I was like, let's go get Starbucks. And um, go to Bath and Body Works. He's like, ugh. And I'm like, and Best Buy. He was like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'll go anywhere as long as I get to go to Best Buy. <laughs> I mean, I'll, I'll go into like. Um, don't say anything. What? Not nice. <laughs> I'll go into Victoria's anything. Secret with you any day of the week, too. Because I like that place. You don't like Victoria's Secret. I love looking at all the pictures. Do you really? Oh, yeah. They have great pictures there at Victoria's there Secret. Whenever, whenever we were together. No, yeah. I'm, I'm totally down to go there any day of the week. Okay. Any day of the week, I'll go there. Are you serious right now? Oh, yeah. Are you being serious? Parsley, yes. Why are these people behind me looking at me weird? <laughs> Those people back there, are they looking at me weird? <laughs> I better stop this. Yay, Best Buy! I feel like like we parked way back over there because that's where the Starbucks was, but we decided we wanted to walk because it's kind of nice out now. I feel like we should do something cool out here though. Here, let's have a dance break. Hi! 
Hi. They didn't okay. wave at me. Yeah, that was a really lame dance. It was bad. You actually pretty much suck at dancing. I know because I didn't want to spill my coffee. Sure, a lame excuse. You guys, I don't know about you guys, I always come here to Best Buy to check out their awesome selection of chairs. What? Oops. Don't don't break anything. I'm in trouble. Psh, it's just the manager. It's no big deal. Yeah, so I'm just sitting here. Uh, whoa, what? Oh, who, who are you? What's your name? My name is Austin. I'm a vlogger on YouTube. Call me. Are you into that sort of thing? Sure, I'm into anything. But <laughs> makes me sound really bad. Oh. Wow, she's really easy. <laughs> All right, here's a question for you guys. Comment below. Do you guys have home phones like these? in your house still or do you guys all just have cell phones like we just have cell phones yeah we, we don't, don't have, have home phones phone. so if you want to call the net but i've always wanted one because i want to say hi it's the nine knows leave a message Beep. <laughs> maybe we should just you know how most people get like a p.o box to like send stuff to let's just get a, a, <laughs> so a nine old phone random just a random cell phone you guys can call and be like hi there's a message for the nine knows that'd be really weird hey guys it's the nine knows here leave a message wait why am i on my own phone that was weird <laughs> Yeah, so we're just here uh, in Best Buy, checking up on the game, you know, checking up on the Bulls. Derrick Rose just playing out of his mind. Literally out of his mind. Literally his mind. It literally he was playing. His mind just fell out. Okay, I get confused with Austin's all of his players because he said that Derrick Rose was really good. So I, what were you saying the other day? And you said something about someone should get that one guy is the best three point shooter. Who is his name? I said, well. Because all I ever do is talk about Kobe, but then I was talking about Ray Allen is yeah, like the best three point yeah. shooter of all time. And I was like, I and, I was like and Derek Rose is going to win the MVP. And she's like, what? I was confused because you have all these things. You said that you thought Derek Rose was the best, but then you said that Ray guy should win. And I was confused. No, I just said Ray Allen was a good shooter. Derek Rose should win MVP, and Kobe's the best ever. Austin also said that I should be a commentator for um, all the Because her commentary <laughs> on basketball is hilarious. It's like, they were shooting the ball, and then they were yelling. I think we're going to move into Best Buy now because look, Chairs, uh, nice relaxing place, a nice little TV. It's a perfect place to live. I don't see why we wouldn't. <laughs> I like it. And they have cable about elephants. Baby elephants. Little baby elephants. I keep getting afraid because there's this one guy that was walking around that works here and he looks like the type that would tell me to put my camera away and go stick my head in the corner. <laughs> so I'm a little afraid to have the camera out when he's walking around. I'm gonna stick it to the man. All right, we're heading home, but we're trying to find some party music because we want to dance, man. We want to dance all up in the car. Yeah, you're not good at finding hey. good party music. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, I like this song, though. T-Swizzle. Like, all right. We're going to do any more T-Swizzle. She was like, like shoot, we got in. She's like, we're going to change it up, listen to party music. Look what we're listening to. T-Swizzle. You just can't go wrong. You just cannot go wrong with T-Swizzle. T-Swizzle. I sound just like her, dad. I'm in the back of me in summer air. Little did I know <laughs> We were Romeo, I was blowing feathers And my daddy said go back to Juliet And I was standing down the steps for the baby I don't know where to go And I said, Romeo, save me Somewhere we can be alone I'll be waiting to the night you see me it's a love story, did you just say yes? Ha ha ha! Taylor Swift for the win! <laughs> Britt's got a new workout tool, so I'm gonna... You can do these. Oh! Four. So it's like you're doing um, curls with nothing. It doesn't feel like nothing though, you uh, need to try it. Okay. Or you can do leg stuff like this, you hold it like this and you do this. It's a resistance band. Oh! So I can get, get the ham hocks off my thighs. Oh yeah, they're real ham hocks, that's for sure. You can get ripped. I'm not kidding. Yeah, that's true. I can see how that would work. Yeah, and now you can do stuff with your legs and I'm stuff tired. too. You should do the workout I did last night. There's a DVD that came with that, and I got it for $5.99. I can't do all that. That's tough. It's the Jane Fonda workout. That's what it's called. Yeah, well, I'll show you my Jane Fonda's. <laughs> Britt's going to go work out. I'm going to edit all of this footage that you've just seen. And uh, Arthur is going to awkwardly stretch. Great job, buddy. You're doing real good at being normal today. I'm real happy, you know? <laughs> Not really. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, also, that link right up there, you need to go watch that. Um, we have t-shirts now. You guys, 
There's like 12 different kinds. Oh, also, shout out to Jamie. <laughs> Holy crap. Gosh, she's crazy. <laughs> You're crazy, I like that. You're hot. Sorry, what were you saying? Um, anyways, I was saying shout out to Jamie, AKA Brain Blast. You can check her out, link right here. Um, right there. Um, check her out. She made two of our t-shirt designs that I just put up last night and they are pretty awesome. So yeah, go, uh, there's, the link is down below. Go check out our t-shirts. If you think they're cool, why don't you buy one and, and show it off to all your friends. There's like 12 different kinds you can buy. We will talk to you guys later. Deuces! I'm gonna say something really loud and see if these people hear me. Yay, boxes! Say you're sorry! You guys, guess what? You guys, come here. No, no, come closer, closer. Come here, come here. We got some t-shirts. Yes, that's right, t-shirts are here.